The Prime Minister, meanwhile, expected to face a rebellion in the Lords when the Brexit bill is debated. There are amendments proposed, including protections for EU citizens in the UK and proposals for a vote on the final Brexit deal. Joining us now, Lord Callanan, a Conservative peer who is pro-Brexit, and Baroness Altman, a Conservative peer who campaigned to remain in the EU. Very good morning to you both. Good morning. morning. Baroness Altman, are you proposing to back amendments which could hold up this bill? I am minded to consider some of these amendments. Um, obviously, we will have the debate in committee and we'll see what the minister says and what the government uh, proposes. But it is my view that the role of the House of Lords is for us to scrutinise legislation and to, if we believe uh, that something has come over from the Commons that might need to be thought about again, to send it back to the Commons and okay. ask... OK, and we just saw in that clip from the, from the documentary series that's about to begin, allegations that there are members amongst you who simply pop into the Lords to collect their allowance. Now, should they be having, those members, such a massive impact on a democratic decision taken by the people? The vast majority of peers work extremely hard for their, uh, for their daily allowance. Baroness um, D'Souza said in the film that this peer shall remain nameless. I think they should be named. We should know yeah. who she's talking about. She can't make allegations without saying who's responsible. Uh, if that has happened, it's disgraceful behaviour and yes. uh, nobody would support that. And what do you think about your colleague sitting next to you who's proposing to support amendments which will, frankly, delay the passage of this bill? I think the problem with Ros's position is that she voted for a referendum to be held. What did she expect the result to be? I mean, now that you got a, ref a result you didn't like, you can't suddenly go back and say, well, actually, you know, I didn't, uh, didn't want not, it in the first place and the therefore issue. I'm going to delay the whole process. People voted to leave the EU in the referendum. The only legal way of doing that is to trigger Article 50. Mm. That's all this bill says. It's only 137 words long. 